Well, everybody, the stakes have officially been raised. If I don't catch something table-worthy, it's hot dogs for dinner again. There we go. Ah, this one's too small for the table. Might have to weed through a bunch of small ones to get to the big ones. There we go. He was just kind of laying on it. down in there. There we go. There we go. Now this one feels like it might be a little bit better. Oh yeah. I think that one's fine table fare. Get him in my bait bucket turned live well here. All right. There we go. Ah, yeah, that's another decent one. Yeah, I think you'll keep. I get a couple of decent fillets off of that one. Alrighty. My dinner is taking shape. go hmm oh you know <laughs> I was trying to judge whether or not it was big enough and in the end it didn't matter there we go Oh, this isn't a sunfish. Ha <laughs> ha A little smally. He's definitely too small to keep. There we go. Ooh. This fish feels like it's got some shoulders. Oh yeah. Oh, there's a jumbo for you. Look at that thing. Heck yeah. Okay, so I got the fish filleted, 
there in this bag. And uh, I didn't do it on camera because I didn't want to embarrass myself. I'm not very good at filleting fish, and indeed it was a hack job on a couple of them, but I was still able to get a decent amount of meat off of them. And what I want to do is I want to make some sliders, some fish slider sandwiches. So we're going to do a simple fry with these fish. In this bowl, I've got plain flour, nothing added. Uh, I've got my egg wash in this bowl. And in this bowl, I've got 4C brand seasoned breadcrumbs. So I'm just going to go ahead and bread these things and get them ready for the frying pan. Lays are all breaded, our oil is hot, so now it is time to have ourselves a fish fry. Alright, looks like our fish is fried to a nice golden brown. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn off the heat and put these on some paper towels to let the excess oil drain off. And then we will start assembling our sliders. So, we got our fish, and we got our slider rolls, which I've toasted up a little bit. And I'm going to show you how I like to have my fish sandwiches. It's real simple. So, just take one of the buns, get a little bit of mayonnaise, put that on there like that. Be a little generous with it. Grab one of these fillets. Of course, they gotta hang over a little bit. And uh, a few pickle slices. So the mayonnaise and the pickle kind of acts as a, a deconstructed tartar sauce. And then the bun goes on top. And then you just repeat the process. Decker that one. Oh yeah. And there you go. Sunfish sliders. Ah, all right. Well, got a couple of sliders, got some slaw, got some potato chips, frosty beverage, meal fit for a king. Let's see how they turned out. Mmm. Fillets are nice and crunchy. 
the mayonnaise and the pickle really complement it. And you can't you can't beat it when it's fresh. I mean this these were swimming around a couple hours ago. So you can't get any fresher than that. And that makes so much difference. And I love sunfish. I love eating sunfish, not just because they're delicious, but there's usually just so many of them around. You can keep a few guilt-free because there's just, you know, millions and millions of them. So, yeah, you can, you can have a few, and uh, it, you're really not going to impact the population any. So, maybe next time you catch a mess of sunfish, consider bringing a few home. Make some sliders. Make whatever you want with them because they are absolutely delicious. So, thank you all so much for joining me, and I will see you on the next adventure.